Welcome to this week's Sound the Shore. If you've been catching the show, you've seen that we all collect things. Today we're going to see Bill's collection. Bill has a vast collection of dolphins, both mammal and football kinds, so he's going to show that to us now. Stay tuned. Okay, I'm here with Bill, and for this week's show, he's showing us his collection on dolphins. So how about we start with the mammal kind? He likes both mammals and football dolphins, right? Correct. This is kind of cool. This, I that. got this from Flor in Florida. Mm -hmm. um, Got like, I think it was one of the outer islands or along the, uh, Florida as it goes out along the, like not Key West, not as far as Key West. I can't think of the, one of the islands, but it's Key West. Yeah, no, it's the only uh, other key I know. So it's uh, it's they at the where I got that they had the um, a dolphin. Um, Basically, with Dolphin Island, they had a, where Flipper was trained, mm -hmm. and it was right in that area. So oh. I got that. There's another one. This one is a little snow globe one, which is kind of yes. cool. Got that in Florida. Has a, actually, it was a gift from Florida. Ah, uh, who gave it to you? Uh, Margaret. Margaret, the star of our show, gave this to him. Isn't that nice? Then he has another one here. This one's kind of cool. That's yeah, a, it's looks like, like a little, kind of like cartoonish. It, yeah, it's um, got it from my mom and dad when they went to uh, Bermuda. That's yeah. really cool. They, they liked it. They knew yeah. I would, yeah. of course. And here's a set of little ones. Yes, th them I got in uh, North Carolina. They're kind of cute. That's yeah. kind of neat. Dolphins are really cool, though. Yeah, they are. I mean, and we get to see them out of the water, which is kind of yeah. neat. Well, when the storms come up, you know, they usually you can see them ride waves. Is and that stuff. the best yeah. time to find them, when the storms are up? Well, they, they like to ride the waves. Oh. They actually ride the waves. Well, that's cool. Check this one out. This one is... <laughs> it's a can opener bo can slash opener. bottle opener, because if you look oh, underneath, check it out. you can open bottles of beer. Or you can open bottles of beer, like... Or soda, because oh, there's a, cool. a lot of young viewers here watching. A lot of young viewers, yeah. Just in, just in case. <laughs> we don't promote drinking under underage drinking. No, we don't. <laughs> now, he also likes the Dolphin Dolphins, the football team. And is this their mascot, or what's this? Yeah, that's the mascot. Um, he's kind of cute, but kind of ugly. <laughs> you know that he's kind of ugly. Look, he's kind of ugly. The nose is just, I don't know. The nose looks like <laughs> Pinocchio, I know. Yeah, it doesn't look like a dolphin nose. I'm no. sorry, it just it doesn't. It's but okay. It's okay, we like him anyway. All right, so what else you got on the Miami Dolphins? Miami Dolphins? Well, this is Miami, but you got to get this nice, oh, yeah, the nice ties. tie. Check it out with the dolphins on it. That's kind of neat. And then he has this one here. This has the dolphins. Ah, uh, they're not moving. Well, also... I also what else you got? Sponsors, oh, yeah. sponsors the bottom of those dolphins. That's cool. And they're um, one of the few dolphins that are like in that slash endangered. Oh, real? Oh, they are they're, endangered. They're going, are they kind of borderline? They're or? borderline right now. Mm -hmm. um, the spinner dolphin. Mm -hmm. That's also one of the borderline ones. And there's two others. Yeah, that's good. Like yeah. Someone's trying to save them. Yeah, I get a newsletter each time, you know, on different things and stuff. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Now, and gate, to, the, gate, what do you want to show us? to Miami. Go, uh, now we're talking about Miami, Miami Dolphins, Dolphins the football, the football team. team. Well, birthday present, I got oh, Miami really Dolphin. Dan Marino. Dan Marino. Your favorite player, is that right? Yeah, no? he's one of the what major players, think? yes. Of mine, and uh, like about the other side, oh, it's go. still damn right now. Oh, that's pretty cool. And another Christmas mug, big football. Oh, players. check it out! It's got the 40-yard line. 
50 yard line. That's kind of neat. They're all the way around. Oh, wow. I haven't put anything in this to no. drink out of it. Do you use this one or no? That one I use for like hot chocolate and stuff when I go skiing, which I don't have with me because, you know, I haven't gone skiing yet, but I got dolphin gloves, scarf, and a hat. Really? Yeah, I'd actually get a ski jacket. Well, dolphins. you do have something dolphin here. This dolphin, uh, what do you call it's it? Wind catcher or something? Wind, yeah, wind veil or catcher. Or That's cool. Do you put it sock. out? Or do you have I haven't it put it out now. For your collection? Yeah, it's just hanging up in my room. Yeah. That's cool. Nothing, nothing real major. Okay. This is, I get this, um, I ordered to a Dolphin Digest. Mm -hmm. This is one of the other media guides that, uh, that we get with the Dolphin Digest, which I'll show you later. Mm -hmm. It show, gives you all the players, some oh. stats, uh, coach, uh, owners, uh, just a lot of different things that, you know, really interesting, you know, you get, also. So if you want to know what it's in the book, right? Also, they got the Oh, check know, it out, the seating plan. And everything, right That's in here. That's kind of cool. Oh, is this directions, too? Directions there, yeah. Well, have you ever been to a game down there? Unfortunately, no? no. No? I lived down there for a year, and I never, never made it went. down. Never went? Yeah. When I was a kid, I was a Yankee fan, so for baseball, all I know we used to go to Yankee Stadium when I was a kid. I haven't been there in a long time, though. So I was telling you about the Dolphin Digest, which comes with that media book when you order it. Um, one nice thing, they give you play-by, you know, they give you a description of what happened in last week's game and stuff. But a lot of these games, a lot of these, I, I've kept because last year, as you know, Marino broke four records. Mm -hmm. Now, and just find the page. This one. We're not really prepared. Yeah, I am. <laughs> this one has all his completions. Yeah, cool. Who caught him? Check it out. When they were caught, how many yards, date, what game, and the name of the person. Hmm. That's really And cool. in what quarter? Can't forget about that. Yeah, do they always do something like if someone uh, breaks a record? If, they if they're do that? doing the records and they're major records like these were, <laughs> this one should be. Uh, which records are these? These might be the touchdown records. As soon as I can find these. <laughs> but these are the things I like to. Marino becomes yardage king. Yardage king. He's a yardage. When, when did this happen? Uh, this also happened... Uh, this past season? No, actually in November of um, 95. Oh, okay. Now they got who, his top receivers, Mark Duper and Mark Clayton. Mm -hmm. you know, those are those top two. And, you know, and then you go down, you know, Fryer, who's still playing football, but no longer with Miami. Who's he, who's he with now? He's with... Uh, the Eagles. Ah, Margaret's team. Margaret's, Margaret's team. Margaret's team, the Eagles. Now they have a few people. Um, on the hill, he's <coughs> losing my voice there. He's okay. still playing for Miami. O.J. McDuffie, he's also still playing. How long has Marino been uh, with the Dolphins? He's been, I think he's gotten, thir this is his 13th year. Oh. He's 35 now. Oh, that's kind of old, old man. He just old man of football. He just turned 35 in September. Oh. Yeah. And he oh, just looked at that just one. looked at that one. And this is when he started to accomplish breaking the uh, records. Hmm. And these should be... I forget to put them closer to the middle of the page. Middle of the paper. Yeah. I'll find it. <laughs> Should have had these open. I know. Let's go back to the mug. It's not, it never attracted. <laughs> oh, where? It's it? not in there. It's in. You here. lied to us. It's in here someplace. He lied to us. Ah, oh, here we go. Ah, ooh, it's a two-page spread. Ooh. <laughs> Completions. The other one, sorry, I made a mistake. The other one was the touchdowns. Oh, okay. That was touchdowns. This yeah, these completions. are the completions. Huh. Mark Clayton's okay. up there. Yep. 
Now, most people thought Duper was his main man, but no, it was Clan. Oh. Yeah. Oh, cool. Okay, well, I see you have some, like, cards with plaques and stuff. Yes. This, I got as a birthday present. Okay, it's 300 mean? TDs plus. And what does that mean? Um, every time he threw, threw a pass, TD touchdown. Oh, okay. You know, I got this also as a gift. That's cool. And what's the other one? Uh, most of the... Oh, this one? <laughs> most of these I got as a gift. Uh, this is one of those uh, playing cards. You now it gives him his stats and stuff mm -hmm. of that year. Do you have, like, uh, his rookie card? Or would, did, did they have that, like, in football? Yeah, they do I, have I a rookie baseball, card. So. They do have rookie cards have and stuff. It. I unfortunately don't have that. Mm -hmm. And that's, right now, a lot, a lot of money. Does it, do you collect, like, um, other cards? Is this all you have as far as cards? This is basically all I have, really, is so cards. So you're not into the cards, too? No. Much. I should be, unfortunately, but mm -hmm. I'm not. Mm -hmm. uh, too complicated to put them someplace and mm -hmm. keep them still. Hey, I keep my Charles Angels cards. I mean, you know, I, uh, you buy, they have the slip. You slip them in the thing. Yeah. They, they stay forever. All right. <clears throat> this is last year's team photo. It has uh, Don Shula, Dan Marino, uh, Cox. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Hmm. It's cool. It's got a little dolphins around it. Did yeah, you actually, have that made, actually this frame, my mom made this really? frame. Oh, that's yeah. kind of neat. And... Most of these players are not playing with the Dolphins this year. Oh, well. I should be getting a team photo of this year's team, hopefully within the next couple weeks. Hmm. Yeah. I understand you have a pillow that your mom, your mom made a yes, pillow, Yes, my right? mom made so a that pillow. That's really cool. Where do you see this? Okay. This is neat. That's a cool pillow. I never know. It's upside down, right side up. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah, I have a lot of nifty neato things. Cool. What else you got? Um. This is cool. Okay, this is a blanket, actually. Do you okay. actually use it, or do you hang you it up? You can use it. Um, do you use it, though? I've used this? it a couple times just to uh, stay warm with mm -hmm. and watching a game out on the porch and stuff when two TVs are operational. My mom wants to watch something in here. Uh -huh. She gets cold in the winter. She has in here. My brother and I are out there watching football until the porch warms up. We got these things wrapped around. They keep you nice and warm. Do they? Yeah. That's cool. So how long have you been a Dolphins fan? Basically all my life. I can honestly say that since I can remember. You know, I've liked the mammal dolphins, so, you know, just as much. And I think that's when I, you're a little kid, you don't separate reality from fantasy, so you kind of go with whatever. So I think that kind of led over for me rooting for Miami Dolphins. When was the last time they were in... Uh the, uh, 85. 85. 85. Did they win? No, they lost to San Francisco. Uh, when was the last time they won? Um, How many have they won? They've won two. They've won two. Uh, they've been, what, four all together. How long has the team been around? Do you know? They, yeah, uh, they were created in 66, uh, 30 years ago. Hmm. Yeah. They've uh, been one of the top teams, you know, Basically through the 70s and even in the 80s, even though they had a up and down year, uh, years I should say, um, they've made the playoffs. Um, trying to think, 23 times. Well, that's pretty good. Though. 21 times, yeah, somewhere in there. They, you know, basically almost every year you can count them into the making the playoffs. Whether they get help or make it to them uh, with themselves, it's you know, all that you know they can do. You don't care if you get there and somebody else loses to get you in there. You don't care as long as you get into those playoffs. Mm -hmm. This is uh, their 25th anniversary yearbook, which I picked up. It gives you the team history, the creator, each year. Hmm. Growth of the franchise. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's cool. And 66, their first year. Hmm. Quick 
effects. What's that? Uh, that gives you an indication who's who is the um, their record. They were three and eleven. Oh, for this year. For the for, first for 1966, they were three and eleven. Hmm. Um, Most valuable player. Players, big win, biggest wins. Hmm. And they give you pictures of some of the players, the record the, of the games they played that year, and the bit, yeah, 19. Uh, 70, Don Shula came into the uh, franchise. They've only had three coaches now. Uh, their new newest coach now is Jimmy Johnson. In and the, in the, the 30-some-odd years? Whole 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 franchise, there's only been three. Wow. Well, yeah, because don't they usually come and go? Or I know that happens They, they usually baseball. go quick, yeah. Do they go as quick for football? Pretty much. You know, that's what it, the trend seems to be. Mm -hmm. uh, well, let's uh, get to the year where they won the Super Bowl. What was it, 85, okay. you said? No, that would be 70s they started moving, 71, and 71 they went to the Super Bowl but lost to Dallas, and 72 was their big year. The only team to ever go the whole season, win the whole thing, mm -hmm. to go undefeated. They're undefeated this year. They won every game they played, really? playoffs and Super Bowl. Really? Is that the, did you say the only team that's ever done that? Only team. In really? Huh. Yeah, so this was the year, the 72. They won the Super Bowl and everything. Uh, a couple teams have come close to winning the entire thing. Um, was it 85? Oh, yeah, sorry, I made a mistake. Uh-oh. He made a mistake, we have to <laughs> correct it. Wait a minute. Oh. Set 84 mm -hmm. is when they went to the Super Bowl. Oh, 84. Okay. Yeah, because 85, they, uh, Chicago was in the Super Bowl, and they were on the run to go undefeated. Mm -hmm. But they had to play Miami, and they were 13 and 0. Mm -hmm. They played Miami, and they lost. Miami won mm -hmm. to make them 13 and 1. Wow. And Miami that year. That must have hurt. <laughs> yeah. Miami that year got made it to the last playoff slot, but lost against New England. And so it was uh, Buff, yeah, Bears and New England in, in the Super Bowl that year. Hmm. What other year were they in? Let's go to that year. And they were also 84. in some of the big plays and stuff. And they were in 83. They were in the Super Bowl. That's 73. Uh, 73. 73, Oops. not 83, 73. Now they, um, this is one of the lowest scoring Super Bowls. What, Wait, 73? No. 73. No, there was one Super Bowl that was, what, 14-7. That's Can't the remember. lowest? That's the lowest that I know of. What, what's, uh... What's been like uh, the Super Bowl where someone was really slaughtered, like big time? Has there been anything like that? Yeah, there's been a lot. Yeah, yeah recent recent games. Um, Dallas and Buffalo. Dallas and Buffalo mm -hmm. have been a couple of the killers that they've had. Mm -hmm. uh, basically, all the time Buffalo's been in it lately, they've been like killed real bad. Uh, the Super Bowl that they were the Dan Marino's first Super Bowl and only Super Bowl right now. Did they win? Is right here in '84. No, they lost. Oh, really? So he doesn't have a Super Bowl, right? No, he's got all the records and everything else, mm -hmm. but no Super Bowl ring. Huh. He started in '83. He got to play a few games, mm -hmm. but then he took over the team, basically, and he won Jordan. Yeah, well, 85 years, most valuable player. Right. Actually, I got that mixed up. In 80, 83, he started. That was his rookie year. Went all the way to the Super Bowl in 84. Right? I don't know. That, get, that gets confusing. I'm getting confused. Here, yeah, it's 86. He was getting uh, most right. valuable player. It gets confusion because the season is in one year, and the Super Bowl's in the other year. And in 87? Boy, how many years was the uh, most valuable player? Probably a lot. What's this, the fire? Uh, that's the fireworks. Oh, okay. I thought there was a fire at the stadium or something. Yeah. But it, it gets confusing to remember when... Yeah, 88? Geez, every year? What's the, yeah. what's the most valuable player every year he's been there? Pretty much, yeah. Huh. 
he's uh, one of the league's top players. Right. Well, as you can tell, he's gotten all the records now right. for right. passing attempts. Now if you could just get yards. a ring. And now <laughs> yeah, just get a Super Bowl he's ring. been fighting for a ring now for yeah. basically ever since. They, everybody assumed that he was going to be back you know, to many, many Super Bowls. But one thing Miami lacks, I think, is a defense for the most part. Uh, so how long, how, how many more years do you think he's got? Well, part? they've signed his contract for another three years. On top of the one year he still has left, so four more years. So it should take him to the year 2000. Whether or not he's going to play constantly at his level or not, one doesn't know. What do you got here? This is a picture. <clears throat> Oh, the it, it gives all his uh, completions, yardage, touchdowns, and attempts. Hmm. Former record was 3,686. Yep. Pass completion as well. And he's also the least injured quarterback. Really? Yeah, he's got bad knees, but for the most part, it's only been recent that he's been knocked out of a couple games. In, um, what was it, 94, he was out with his Achilles tendon and stuff. All right, so what else do you have to show us? Right, I got these lithograms, which I also got from the Dolphin Digest, because they had a man in the could order. Oh, wow, look at that. That's really sharp. Who's this? This is... Is remember. that Larry's uncle? Yeah, Larry's uncle. Hey, I knew. <laughs> Check it out. Anyway, oh, that's really cool. Is this supposed yeah. to be his uh, signature? It's his signature. And it's numbered and everything? This is numbered. There's a thousand copies. Mm -hmm. And that's number 146? Yes. And that's really Most cool. valuable player of the uh, seventh Super Bowl. Oh, what other ones? you have a couple of these? Yeah, I got a total of four. Mm -hmm. Check it out. That's really neat. Nice artwork. Yeah, that's really cool. What's the next one you got? This is... Uh, so I need your hand to hold this. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got another one. Let's see. This is Bob Greasy, quarterback. Hmm. He was the quarterback that was the quarterback of the Dolphins when they went undefeated mm -hmm. that year. So he has a couple rings. Really sharp. What's the next one you got? That's really neat. So these you don't hang up, right? You just uh, I haven't yeah, I mean, until I get like a good frame with a mat and all that. Yeah, hang these up. There's Dan Marino. Dan Marino. Sure. Back to Dan Marino. Back to Dan Marino. What is he? The Miami Dolphins? Is that it? Yeah, basically <laughs> that's what he seems like the man that they hope that they have in the team. Because every time they don't have him playing, mm -hmm. it seems like the team really kind of goes down. Really? Yeah. What are they going to do when they don't have him anymore? I don't when know. They retire. I don't know. That's cool. Yeah. And then last but not least. Last but not least is what? Don Shore. He's a coach, isn't he? He's a coach. He uh, retired mm -hmm. um, last season, the end of last season. Yeah, he, uh, he has a... Did he ever win a Super Bowl as a coach? Or? Yes, he did. He did? He did. Yeah. He won a lot. He didn't win with uh, the Colts because he was a quarterback of the coach, uh, Colts. Um, he was in the Super Bowl with the Jets. Uh, it was the Jets and the Colts, and the Jets won. And the Jets weren't supposed to win, but the Colts could not do a thing. Huh. That's really cool. I was with uh, Joe Namath. Oh, okay. Yeah, Joe Namath. Good old Joe Namath. Good old Joe Namath. What do you got? This is hey, your jacket? This is my jacket. You actually wear Light it? Or? Yes, I do. You this do. is my lightweight jacket. I've got a heavyweight jacket. It's still not not out yet. That's really cool. What's on the front? Front? Just the... Uh, just the... That's cool. 
I got this from the Sears catalog. Sears catalog. Yeah, it was good for something. <laughs> <laughs> they don't make the Sears catalog. No, that's why. That's why I can say that. Yeah, yeah I, I got can't, the Sears catalog. can't put the Sears catalog down. And hey, remember when you were a kid, you couldn't wait for the Christmas one. Oh yeah. You know, it's like, hey, I need the Sears catalog. These are. What do you got? Oh, we got more dolphin pictures. He likes these dolphins. are dolphin. Um, yeah, I don't know how is this camera work wise. Do we need the tilt? How's that? Can you see it? <laughs> cool. That's Th really neat. This I got as a birthday present. Yeah, really nice because you get get to see the dolphin coming out. There's another dolphin here. Oh yeah. Now one nice thing about this, uh, it kind of reminds me of the beach a lot because um, we do the kayaks going out on the kayaks doing patrol. And occasionally when the dolphins do come by, get out there. I've been lucky. I've been close to the dolphins. I've had them within inches of the kayak. So are they around the winter time or no? They, uh, they, no, they're they mostly, migrate, they, they more or less migrate farther. And when did they start showing up? Um, Would it be May or not until June what, or It depends. July? The water has to warm up before you can really see them closer inside. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, they're pretty much in the Gulf Stream all the time because the water there is fairly warm. Mm -hmm. Cool. What's the next one? I got the next one. This I got. This one I got in Hawaii. And Joe, last but not least, one of my T-shirts. One of many. One of many. One of many of the Miami Dolphins and of just the regular Dolphins. I got a really nice one that we started to play. Kind of looks like that. It's of the Dolphins and it says After Hours. Yeah, cool. all, all them play and stuff. It looks really cool. Well, thanks for showing us your collection. Sure. We appreciate it, and we hope that you enjoyed it. Well, that's all the time we have for this week's show. We hope you enjoyed looking at Bill's collectibles and all of our collectibles. In the future, we'll be showing other people with their collectibles. We already have lined up someone who collects Star Trek memorabilia and someone who collects angel stuff. And if you have a collection you'd like to tell us about, you can write to us at Down the Shore. P.O. Box 607. Seaside Heights, New Jersey. 08751. Nobody wants to say the first goodbye. Every time I see you cry. Now I'm the fool